All right, big giant floating video one. Click the Xbox on. All right. So we're going to be playing some of these um, prototypes that were released on Vision Palace. We're going to be playing it on a 1.6 uh, Xbox. Um, it's because I tried playing Pac-Man on my 1.1 uh, and I noticed a glitch that didn't happen um, in CXBX, but we'll get to there when it is uh, makes more sense. So we're gonna go look for these prototypes. Um, and I mean, I guess so. First, we'll start off with Vats because it's the most interesting, I think. But it's also um, has a little bit of issues. Let me turn up my speakers here. So I don't I don't know if they're even on. Yeah. See that is creepy. That Genghis Khan looking dude. We're turning on a I gotta turn on a fan. It's just so hot in here. Well no matter what you know, either have that on and make noise or have it off and I'm gonna be fucking asleep. Okay, I think that's enough of that tax. Where's my dude? There you go. Alright. So the Vax. Or the Vat? I don't know. I really don't know. So it gives us instructions in the top left. I guess this is why they think it's a um, demo. In the video, MBG just posted like 30 minutes ago. He said it was like... Uh, a vertical slice, which I haven't even got that far in actual hardware, and you'll see why. But first, we'll talk to him. You see, he even says, if you feel like cheating, press X to get full ammo. If you feel like cheating, press Y to get all the weapons. In this, you scroll through with the right stick, which is kind of interesting. Um, so, and he gives us a few options. These two... Maybe they like, that's like you selecting your faction, but this is, I never hit this before, that's, okay, yeah, so I can, I can double down or, um, I guess, that means I'm going to join him and become like a vampire edgelord, and that just means I'm going to be just like, um, I don't know, maybe like a shit poster or something, but. Um, let's be the edge lord because is that Zach with two K's? Wow. See, that's why this game never could be published because that is a mistake. Oh, whoa! I turned the camera as I was turning the corner. So if I selected that second option, I walk. This door is open instead, and this one is locked. Um, but with this one. Um, crashes so then we're in here let's walk around here check take a note at the lighting on the seats and it looks like an advanced Wii game kind of advanced lighting you know the Wii could do better graphics all right so I mean, let's ask him about possession because we won't It'll, it'll crash after this. Receptacles. Yada, 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 yada. Alright, so I guess A makes it skip faster. I don't think I'm a possessor. I've never felt a vampire. Feel a vampire. Oh my gosh. Alright, well, let's just go because. So I guess you can pick any seat. Let's try giving herself all weapons first. I hit Y and I hit X. I guess I don't have a weapon, so there is none to, none to shoot. I hit the buttons. Unless it's black and white. No. Nope. Alright. See, and then you select. So they. Uh, you can only select one. And then as soon as you do. Yeah. 
these you can progress and zoom you like I was talking about you can um, just select a debug BIOS. Uh, you you might have to in general um, but the key thing is to make sure you have 128 megabytes of RAM enabled and this is on S video too like I've, you didn't I, I don't think you'd be able to tell I'm very surprised with this um, little Trinitron that I got my father Run a little, I mean, I got 10 minutes left on my uh, storage here before I, I have to erase some of my old footage and then I can record like hours again. Um, I just got to free up my phone. Alright, so let's go back to Strike Pac Man World Rally. And like, you can play these in ZMU. Um, I'm kind of probably not. I'm going to wait till I get this 128. Well, not this model, my um, 1.1 Xbox, 128 megabytes of RAM modded. So I gotta figure out how to do it. So this, this will not crash, at least if I'm quick, so I can show you what the issue is. So I wonder if you can unlock these because you'll see why in a minute, progression will not work. So, if you don't have 128 megs of RAM, any time you're in a mode with CPU racers, it will kind of just not display anything. That does not happen in uh, Zemu or CXBX Box. Tried both, it works. It's the. And I was about to give up all hope. This is the game I really was excited for, was Pac Man. Because I really like this game in the GameCube. But. Let's play through the tracks here. So Mr. Driller. I had to take that one of my CRT monitors and I had to put it on, um, cause I'm in a small room right now, I had to put it on a bed and I'm sitting right next to a CRT monitor and it's, it's cozy. Oh my, oh God, okay. This car does not turn, but it looks, I want to say it looks, um, it has more shading than the one the GameCube did, but it's tough to tell. Maybe it's a uh, higher internal resolution. The GameCube version is 60 FPS. I think the PS2 version is only 30. This game is like Mario Kart GP, kind of, but with, um, Mario Kart 8 or Mario Kart Wii style drifting. Except it's a little bit more clunky, but it's fine. I recommended this game to someone on Reddit on the GameCube because they were looking for a good kart uh, racer to play. That's not Mario Kart. And you know, people, you know, you could say Mario Kart GP, but the drifting of Mario Kart GP is different. Um, and the tracks are just really, there's not much to them. But I'm not surprised because I think a Namco studio helped Nintendo with Mario Kart GP. Yeah, once well, he has more graphical effects, I don't know. I have to do a comparison one day on these games. I'm gonna do one on He-Man. I I don't. I have it on my PS2. Um, I have it on my PS2 hard drive, but I don't have my PS2 hooked up to this TV right now. So that will be. Maybe I'll show the PS2 version. He man off another day. Oh god. See, I was just talking. Can I do a Y turn here? It's a shame this game, uh because I didn't grow up with an Xbox. I grew up with a GameCube and PS2. So when I got this Xbox in last December, and, uh, and that's when I learned about this game too for the GameCube. Um, and I tried it on my on my modded Wii. And uh, I really I wish I had an Xbox version. And I remember looking it up too, and I remember seeing it was canceled. And I told my brother, I thought if this ever releases on the Xbox, uh, that'll be great. I didn't actually believe it that it would, but here it is. So there you go.
Items work too, I haven't really been using them. Is that it? Oh, okay. Alright, let's do the other lap. Or the other track. Alright, because we only got seven minutes left before um, I'll make another video. Oh, I got a hair on the screen. I didn't even see. Oh. See, okay, maybe that's a, a uh, sign. Oh wait, shit, that's the same. That's the same track. I guess maybe that means the next track in the queue. Yeah, so I'll have to remove that hair off the screen. If I'm not going to tell you where it is. Spooky. Well, there. I think Spooky is in this game. Oh shit. Well that is spooky, isn't it? I'm a ghost car. I I did not see this happen. Um Alright. Let me try restarting the Xbox. Let me see if I got a free RAM or something. Alright. Now that I'm thinking about it, our boy Tommy Tellerico did some music in this game. I don't know if in the Xbox one, but he did for, uh, I remember seeing him in one of the credits, I think. I don't know. Maybe it was Pac-Man World. No, I'm pretty sure it was this game. Maybe it was both. Alright, so this is after I in-game reset and I opened the app application bag again. Yeah, okay, and now we're, okay. So, oh, so it's, we were there for a second before it zoomed in on the sign. And then as soon as it zooms back away, we're gone. So, let's see if we can beat the game like this. Okay. It's not the right way. Oh shit. You would think they wouldn't be able to hit me because I'm not there. You said I think we're all out of RAM. Okay, so um, let's let's do battle mode quick before I'm all out of time. Yeah, quick race does not work either. Um, lost car, well, last car. Okay, it's, and that's the only battle map. And this mode does work. I don't. Okay, yeah. So CPU. Battle opponents. I don't know if, huh? Are they just ghosts or are they normal? That see, I don't know if these are the normal characters you'd play as in Grand Prix. Oh yeah, there is. Yeah, because there's a Pack Devil there. Okay, yeah. So they are. Okay. Well, it looks like I have some readout in the bottom left here. I don't know what that is. It looks like it says 62. It jumped up to 100 something when I when I'm drifting. Maybe that tracks like. Mm, seems to be related to acceleration and deceleration. Because when I hit, you no. Know, whoa. Hey, at least my Duke Rumble works. I'll be making some tutorials on um, some various controllers I have and how to fix them. Um, this Duke, I got all lubricated up. I could put a little bit more super lube in the joystick, but uh, so far I'm really happy with everyone. So, okay, I can't tell I'm done. So, alright, that's it for Pac Man. Next time you'll see us, we'll be playing uh, He Man. And there will be no hair on that screen. I might turn that on. I think the white balance is good. I don't know. 